inept and inappropriate like seconds before G Town joins the channel, and he'll join and leave pretty much immediately. <laughs> <laughs> G-Town definitely is, is, is one that wants you to be for real for just a second, please. <laughs> it, I feel so bad, too, because I, I know it's always my fault. Oh, I, I try so hard. <laughs> it was really and nice to see you get so today, far. Though. I hadn't seen Gene Town. Oh, wow. Gene Town. Gene's Town Tom uh, since uh, Big House. Where, of course, we didn't really hang because helping around the tournament. Oh, turn around. We got the fight tag. Red. Scarlet. Throughout that, this sequence, David's used the Marth up B in some interesting ways to like continue the edge guard even when getting the weak hit. I think he feels pretty comfortable with this matchup. I think I think he kind of likes to have Yacht in front of him too, which is something that Ganon kind of kind of just gives you by default, you know? Yeah. Because obviously Ganondorf doesn't really want to be coming much from below you because he doesn't get a ton out of like up air strings. He can do like you know like like first hit and air stuff, but. Gandorf typically, you know, just wants to be facing you. Kind of gives. Yeah. Not a cross-up character at all. No. So Martha, <laughs> Martha so does not really slow. have to play the dash dance game quite as heavily. Yeah, become, I mean, become a wall. You know, you don't need me to tell you that Marth Ganondorf is good for Marth, but I think I think this is a matchup that uh, that Kevar can do quite well in. Fight Dale. It's my favorite city from Hunter Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Great weight on the on the pretty telegraph there on the top right there. Yeah. This one's gonna connect, but plenty of survivability Ooh. left from David here. Mech putting himself in a tough position under the stage. See me here. Uh, Kevin more honorable than me. Me there, I'm planking ledge. <laughs> Do something about it down two stocks when I'm at 115. You know, just for a little bit. Yeah, I feel that. I mean, David gave it, it like four. It, if you're a character with like decent enough lead refreshes, Invincible Ganon is not that scary. Yeah. <laughs> he's not fast. He's not gonna steal it from you. He's not gonna come over the ledge and, and hit Marth that's like uh that's like a C stick dropping and then uh, bearing and then jumping back to ledge. He doesn't have anything that does that. Without putting him in a lot of danger. Alright, breaks out the Batmobile. Ooh. David's gone for I need to start calling him David. Um Cover's gone for a lot of those uh um. Oh my God, I'm gonna freak out. Air dodge recoveries today. It's done like a four, and just what I've been watching. I hate when I don't have the name for something immediately. One of the things that drives me crazy. Yeah, yeah. Just searching your brain for the right words. Absolutely. And the thing is, there's nothing else in there. I'm just walking down a long hallway. <laughs> it's not like there's a library and I'm looking for the right book. <laughs> there's just a. It's like a. You know, uh, uh, Timmy Turner's dad has like the the like trophy pedestal at the end of a really long hallway. It's like that. <laughs> well, what's in yours? Uh, <laughs> uh, that's where my fact about uh, David's gameplay would be if I had one. <laughs> <laughs> the one piece of knowledge I can contribute to this stream. No. And it's just so far away. It's in one of those hallways where it's like the it's like forced perspective, so it looks like it goes really far, but it's actually like three feet long. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, this got dangerous quickly. Yeah, you want to be out of the corner in, here. Unfortunately. Uh, yeah, you. That, you know, pretty much went exactly how how Calvar might have wanted it to there. Mike does get his jump back, but still got Ganon in an edge guard situation. This should be clean upable. Oh. Really high percent now. Get out the Swiffer. Smart there to just wait out the. Um, Nice. Descending fair on the recovery and, and whiff punish that instead of trying to challenge directly. Great recovery. One Not more a ton you can do there, here. Smart. You have to super hard commit. Crosses up with the Nair, forces a whiff grab. I think the key here is just to be careful and not to get too coy in the corner. Yeah, I, th I think you just take any hits you can get there at this point because eventually one of them is going to be the one you need. Don't uh, make your neutral too linear just because they're at 217%. Like you still have all the all the chips on your side of the table. Basically, don't just walk up and give him the keys to your house and he won't break in. <laughs> mech, mech might find a way to break in even without <laughs> the keys. All, all those push-ups have to be leading to something. He's just going to bust the door down. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> He's going to jump through a second story window. <laughs> Oh, man. 
my mom got really paranoid about her safety living alone with like a glass door in her back patio. So she got all these cameras and all she does with them is watch turkeys that come into her backyard. So, I mean, ultimately it was a good investment. Yeah, true. It's like Tony Soprano. I mean, they, they <laughs> <laughs> she's, got her, she's, she's up. got her ducks. She <laughs> loves her ducks. Yeah. There's something about those turkeys. Uh, now she's gonna have she's gonna start having dreams about the turkeys and having to explain <laughs> to her therapist who is Lorraine Bracco for some reason. <laughs> yeah, it could happen. Very uh, very uh, Italian part of town where uh, where we live up in uh, Wolcott. Shout out, shout out to Wolcott. Shout out to Waterbury. If you're from Waterbury, put your hands up. You're you're probably There's not. Nobody with their hands up in <laughs> chat right now. I'm sorry. If, if, if you're at home and you're from Waterbury, put your hands up. <laughs> I'm not either. <laughs> <laughs> I guess there used to be a local in Waterbury before my time. Like long, long ago, according to G Town. G Town's a lore dispenser, too. He's like an Elden Ring NPC. <laughs> <laughs> if you if you keep pressing A, G Town will tell you so much stuff. <laughs> it's always like vague lore spoken in riddles yeah. and analogies. <laughs> he keeps giving you objects that you can like <laughs> infer something about. Yeah, yeah this controller. <laughs> yeah, the examine text on some of this shit is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> all the all the blood stains in front of Tom. <laughs> All right, so Mech was off to a, a much stronger start this game. Um, had a, I think a two-stock lead for a little bit there, and David has brought it back to relatively even. This is going to be a difficult position to recover from. On the grab. grab. He's dead. Yep. Put a lid on it. Now this actually is, uh, yeah. I mean, now it's really tough, but it is just a pretty tough combat here. Ganderf lives forever. Yeah. We have seen Kalvar with some juicy openings in this set, though. Um, now it's uh, just... Now it's over. Now it's now, impossible. Now, now you <laughs> use your jump and got fair. Typically, not what you want it to happen. It, it One uh, might even say that you hate to see that happen. Inadvisable. You hate to see it. Unless you're a mech fan, in which case... <laughs> Nobody it's liked one, this. It's 1-1. One. Everybody liked the. Yeah, it's nice to see just, uh, you know, out of region representation at New England Locals. Yeah, we love when the random GameStop employee comes through. <laughs> but let us win. Hold it down. No, he's a shareholder. <laughs> <laughs> he got on the wave late. He bought the, he bought the, the dip of the dip. <laughs> but he's got diamond hands. He's not letting super it go. Super diamond, <laughs> super diamond. Got diamond spade hands, digging deeper and deeper like a mole. <laughs> Scoop like diamond hands, cutting through rocks. Enough. <laughs> he was just too busy touching grass to get on the original True. Wall Street Bets train. I mean, when, you, when you're doing push-ups, touching carpet, more, more touching realistically, tiles. he was like too busy watching anime, but it, <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Michael touch uh, <laughs> grass, carpet, tiles, wherever there's a push-up to be done. <laughs> Wood floor. I wouldn't be doing push-ups at a major venue. You don't know what's been on that floor. <laughs> Mike would do push-ups on a pile of glass. Yeah? Oh, I thought you, for a second I thought you said I would. <laughs> <laughs> I would do push-ups <laughs> on a pile of glass. Go off. <laughs> Only if I was really sad that day. <laughs> Imagining Mech doing like push-ups across one of those hot coal beds and like monks <laughs> walk across. <laughs> they got monks doing all sorts of crazy shit. Lighting leave themselves them. on fire. Yeah, leave them alone. Well, I, under, I understand that one. Uh, shout out to uh, Tich Kwan Duk. Uh, that's the, the guy you're thinking of. did it in protest, yeah. Rest in peace. Uh, brave and beautiful man. Um. That's what we're going to be saying at the end of this set, one way or another. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! Wow. Oh, my God. He, he does it for the fans. If, if there's one well, thing you, know. you can say about Mech, he does it for the fans. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All the fans back in Dale. 
Okay. Sorry, I, I had to move it around. I, I've been hearing like some cracks too. That's probably okay. Sorry, just uh, losing my mind a little bit. This is Marth's Big armor jab, slowly being jab broken the down. Jab. Marth, uh, <laughs> Ganondorf jabbing Marth's jab. Marth getting a jolt of electricity, conducted up his sword straight into his dainty little arm. Marth's so cute. <laughs> the crowd wants Ganondorf. Yeah, I mean, Marth should inherently be at a disadvantage against some of these electricity effects. You know, he's just holding a giant lightning rod in his hand. Wow, did that phantom shield poke? <laughs> is, is that like a thing that can happen to Bailey? I don't even know. I heard a, I heard a hit sound. Did you hear it? I missed the situation, honestly. Uh, he, uh, mech downbeat uh, cover shield. Yeah. I swear to God I heard a hit sound. Maybe I just heard an echoed sound like through my headphones. Boom. They really gave Ganondorf the sound effect for that thing, too. You know? Yeah. He, he, th he throws a bass drum at you attached to his hand. Melee sound design incredible in general, but Ganondorf, one of the one of the prime examples. Some of the sounds of Melee are really funny, like <laughs> footstep sounds. Like, yeah. <laughs> what, what, okay, no more of that. Um, <laughs> but there's like there's like a bunch of like weird... No, no, clicking. please give me your no. fox running impression no. for another no. five minutes. <laughs> if you just listen to that sound... I, 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 I want it to sound like I'm playing Cup of Water right now. <laughs> Uh, you sound like a cup of water is on comms with you. <laughs> Shadow cup of person I don't know at all. Uh, okay, I can hear. I'm like kind of tripping right now. I'm like, it's all good. I'm not good with like big headphones on my head. Yeah. There was a time during That's COVID fair. where I had headphones on my head so much they like affected my hearing. You know what I'm talking? <laughs> yeah, you had that. Everyone, everyone's got that moment <laughs> where you affect your hearing with headphone use. Oh, that's a huge grab on the nair. We're running. That's a dead, dead mark. Yeah, every day over quarantine, those footsteps in Warzone got quieter and quieter. <laughs> Just disappearing down the alleyway. My family's got macular degeneration. Where'd that guy come from? So that's probably gonna happen to my uh, my vision. I'm really looking forward to that. To yeah, you could friend. just lose all of your senses. Yeah, I mean, you could do that. I can get a tank to do that right now. David had something white and then tossed it. Was it a towel? Oh, a mask. You're gonna oh, I thought you were. <laughs> I, I was like, what are you talking about? I can barely see because I was no glasses. You're going to come out of your sensory deprivation tank and immediately sign with the New York Jets? Percocet. Miley Percocet. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. That sounds like five years old now. Remember this? Yeah. <laughs> hey, welcome to being on comms with me. I'm sorry. <laughs> nah, I'm having a great time. I'm not the one that said mask off. I was goaded. <laughs> I was goaded into action. Right, let's. Oh. Marcy these days, if they do one hit of the side B, they're doing all of them. It doesn't matter what's happening. <laughs> yeah, for years and years, it's just, you know, the, the one hit. And now, now they, yeah, they, they, re they remember they have all these other ones. It's Zane's fault. Like, actually, actually a Zane thing. Remember when people used to try to go for the, the side B down three spike? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I feel like that was a uh, common like like Mewtwo King style when he's it's like so playing someone cool. who's way better than him. I honestly think it's so cool. People should do it more. Marston all the swag they can get, you know? Yeah. People like people like don't think Zane is cool. People are like, I respect Zane. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> like I respect his play and his ability. Which yeah, valid. Yeah, the, 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 the new like commentator thing has <laughs> meant to like shit on Zane for only styling yes. when he's up like three stocks. <laughs> <laughs> like I remember this Zane from like 2017. What, Where's he been? Non-stop edge canceling off platforms on yeah. Yoshi's. Dude. Losing to Falcon. <laughs> All right, so we got Calvar down a game and almost a stock here. Let's. There's the plank I was looking for. In uh, game one, yeah, way back in the old days, it, Mech has 
broken through the layers of shame that David had, and, and, and now he's going to show <laughs> his, his true colors. He's at the core. The mask came off. We're right in the middle of David's brain right now. How many magic punches does it take to get to the Tootsie Roll Center of David Coyne? We're commenting this one. We're commenting this one from uh, the Magic School Bus. That, that's what the sub put on the TV when we shut the lights <laughs> off. We're in the deepest layer of psyche, which is a physical location. <laughs> oh, that was oh, actually oh, man, that to was huge. Not get hit by that up air, but also oh, gets hugged. The ups, there are just a lot of things happening right now. The up hit was so terrible and unfortunate. That was almost a huge swing for Calvar. Well, we're just kind of in the oh, air. Oh, meant to up we, we missed the up tilt. Okay, it could still clean it up here, but... <laughs> Gandalf went a mile off the... Gandalf went from like... Yeah, tip or bear, not enough. <laughs> with, th with that, um, I think that was F throw into, into, uh, into tech away. Gandalf went literally like three yeah. quarters of the stage. He went so far. There was actually no following that up. All right, it's now or never for David. You don't want to lose this stock. Only at 20%. Oh! We're, we're getting some risks out. Oh my god. Okay, that tipper could be big. Shipper. Sets up an edge guard. No jump. We're getting 80. All right, we'll take 80. Getting Mech, even more now. Mech is a big roll through her. I will say. That is probably going to do it. David showing a little bit of frustration. Let's see if he can. This is this is doable. This there we go. This is Okay, this is stuck here. Okay, just going out and getting it. You got to get it how you get it sometimes. That's why oh. I told him earlier. Calvar thought he was in position for that tipper. Just barely misses. Could be big. Turn around with the neutral B. Oh, wow. That's We're all with it. Oh! Big percent, though. Big percent for Mech. Oh! Ooh. Oh, my God! The stuff in these wizards' feet. Stuff Plural. in the feet. I don't want to see it. Oh, Ooh. he just sends it with the... the Forward Traversing air. the entire stage with rolls. Ganondorf cartwheeling okay, across the stage. going to clean it up there. Still a chance this for Calvar. This is so tough. This is so tough. has already, okay, already fared twice. There's the bear. That wraps it. All right, good stuff to Meg. Continuing on in this bracket.